Philo class. This is for the dancing and the dreaming, which is from How to Train Your Dragon 2 by popular request. Now, the form of this song is A A B B A A prime. So we're going to go through the A section. We're going to go through the B section. We're going to go through A prime. And then I'm going to do a playthrough of the entire song A A B B A a prime. Okay? So, the beginning starts on an up bow on a short note on open G. So it's G1 on the D, D1, 3, D, 3 on the G, 1 on the D. Remember this? We worked on it in class. I'm going to play it. very slow. The next part is exactly the same except that instead of D, three on the G, one on the D, it goes D, three on the G. So the D is transformed into a half note and then we just stop after the three. We don't play the one. This is the second part of the A section. Then, the A section basically repeats. We have that first part again. Rest. So that is the difference. This time we have G1, D1. D, three, one, rest. And then it ends with D, three on the G, D, one, three on the G, one on the G. So this is after the rest. I'll play that part really slow because that's different. still have questions about that or you're having any trouble, just rewind the video and go through it again. I'm going to go on to the B section right now. The B section has the same kinds of rhythms that we had in the A section, but on some different notes. The B section starts third finger on the G, and then it goes to open A. So it goes three A, three on the D, so we start three on the G. Three on the G, A, three on the D, A. Listen. Also starts on an up bow. So, starts on the G. A, D, A, A are the strings, right? Then on the D it goes one, D, one. Now this is the same kind of pattern as in the A section, because guess what happens next? We have the almost same thing, except now we've got that half note. That's different, so this time it's three A, three A, three, and now half note one, D. Then we're going to have that little repeat, like the beginning of the B section. And then it's just going to be open D, three on the G. One more time, very slow. Okay, now let's do a very slow playthrough of the B section since this is new. One, two, three.
great job. Remember, you can always rewind the video and work on it some more. Now let's go through A prime. A prime is exactly like the A section for the first five measures. So I'm just going to play through those five measures. They're an exact repeat of the A section. Here they are. <laughs> start to get a little bit different. We play the first three notes the same, but then instead of the rest, we have a note. So it's going to be D, three on the G, one on the D, three on the D. Listen. Let's practice that again. You go open A, three on the D, open A, one on the A, and then low two on the A. And that's the end of the song. And you're done. Let's do a really slow playthrough of A prime, since that's also new. And then we're going to do a complete playthrough of the whole song. Here is A prime. Great job. Now in the actual song, A prime is going to speed up. So right now, I'm going to do a full run through closer to the real tempo. If you're not ready for this, don't worry. You can either just listen. You can listen and sing along. You can listen and pluck along. Uh, or you can go back and practice more with the practice parts of the video. So this is going to be A, A, B, B, A, A prime. And we will speed up in A prime. Here we go. One, ready, go.
the big exciting finish. All right, there you go. Good luck and happy practicing.